All right, everybody, welcome to Dicey Dungeons. Already, I'm liking this music. Let's play. Uh, make sure to like and subscribe and go follow me on Rumble. Welcome to Dicey Dungeons. The only game where you could win your heart's greatest desire. But will you fulfill your dreams or your nightmares? Let's find out with our hosts for this evening and for eternity. It's Lady Luck. Thank you, thank you all, my dears and my darlings, and welcome back to my labyrinth of endless terror. We will welcome our newest contestants. Will our newest contestants win big or lose it all? Oh no! Let's find out as we meet the warrior. Well, I'm a dice. Yes, dear, that's how that works. Mm. Tell me, warrior, what's the secret emptiness that has driven you to risk your eternal imprisonments at the hands of faith? What? Uh -huh. My dear, what are you playing for today? Well, I'm playing to win a monster truck. And to become the strongest man in the world. Mm -hmm. Inspirational. Uh -huh. Well, you know what they say here in Dicey Dungeons. Oh. Luck might be against you, but it's to change your mind now. Click, over, click, click on the chest to walk to it, okay? Sword. S word. Sword. It's an enemy. Charge. This is my first time playing the game. Just like episode 1 of Rebel Link was the first time playing that game. B Space Marine. Ah, new contestant. Trying to fire Plasma Blaster again. Dragon dice to your sword to use it. Deal 5 damage. Nice, because he used a 5, it did 5 damage. Now it's his turn. Click the end turn button. He needs 20 and he gets to do 10 damage. How much health do I have? Dude, this dice is all beat up. Look, there's like a hit there, hit there, hit there, hit there, hit there. That's a 6, that's a 4, that's a 5. Let me think. I actually have a dice right here. So if that's... A 6, that's a 4, that's a 5. That means in this other arm, that's a two. His face is a three, and his feet are a one. Although I do have another dice here, and it's the exact same as well. Okay, good. Just wanted to make sure I was 100% right. Yeah, okay. Oh no, you rolled a one. It's okay, this happens from time to time. The warrior has a special ability. You can re-roll up to three times a turn. Reroll. Four, try again. A three, one more try. A six, perfect. Use the sword. Bam, six damage. Click end turn button when you're ready. Oh, now I have 24 health. Cause that won't kill me. Uh oh. Could do 10 damage. What's this? Double next action. When you take damage, it'll charge to your limit break. Use fury. Click on fury to use it. We're all charged up. Roar. Next equipment can be used twice. Oh, it just uses it twice. Wow. This seems overpowered. I have no clue how to play this game. Watched the guy play it for a very small period of time. So I semi know what's going on, but at the same time, I have no clue. Another enemy, Hothead. more powerful than your sword, but it needs less than a four. Okay, let's reroll this. No. No. There we go. Deal eight damage, and over here, deal six damage. I need to do ten more damage, and you're dead, hothead. The fireball, for example, it's going to burn. What's burn do? Deal. Burn. Dice. Damage. Burn one die. So it's going to deal either three, three or six damage, probably six, fire damage, and it's going to burn one die. And the burn, oh, it's going to cost me two hearts to use it. Eh, that's fine. Let me reroll the die. Let's use Fury, just because I don't like this guy. I'm very angry. Hey, we leveled up. Maximum hearts increased by four. And you receive an extra dice as well. You get all your health back when you level up. Cool. Give me. Burn one die reusable. And bump one die value. 
Okay, cool. The Jester. There's another guy who we saw in the very beginning. Jester changes equipment every time. Hey there, friend. Your enthusiasm is adorable, but I'll let you in on a secret. It's time for you to die. Actually, this is perfect. Let's use this here. That's an even. And it's reusable. I'll reroll this die. I'll reroll the. Oh, no, I, no, I'll keep this one. I'll reroll all this. Fine. Confound it all. There we go. Freeze one die. What does freezing do? Can I just not use it? I mean, at least it's not doing damage. Oh, it just turns into a one. Okay, well, reroll. Reroll. And reroll. Confound it all. Let's burn more of his die. Let's do one damage to him. Well, is it where's where he's supposed to die here? He has 50 HP. I mean, at least he's just using things that don't do damage. What does shock do? Temporarily disables random equipment. Confound it. Let's get the battle axe. Reroll until we get something fine. That's good. Let's burn one of his die. I think we're supposed to lose here, but he hasn't done any damage. He is gonna burn me twice, meaning two of my dice I just can't use. Let's re-roll this. Re-roll, I wanna use Battle Axe. There we go, we bump up it, and we do eight damage. Fine, I'll lose five health. And you know what, let's just do this. Cause why not? Yes, he needs odds, so that, that stops him from weakening our equipment. Oh, he took the damage. He took the damage. Temporarily weakens random equipment, but becomes less powerful. That's not that bad, actually. Let's just reroll this one. There. You're dead, kid. Could have sworn it was time for you to die. Is my watch wrong? What time do you make it? I guess his watch is wrong. Wait, is this no longer a tutorial? Take. More health. Eat. Go start to fight the wizard. We have another bump. Honestly, I don't really like matchstick. Let's just have two bumps. We're gonna cheat and raise the die. You're not wearing socks. Okay, now you are. Now he's not wearing socks again. Actually, let's just use this right here real quick. We'll bump up this die value and do this. And now there's nothing we can do with that extra dice. I just realized that now. Oh my goodness. One, deal five damage, freeze two dice. This guy's powerful. We have to kill him right here and right now. Oh my goodness, I got like the worst case scenario. Alright, let's use Fury. Should've just bumped the dice there and I would've won. Now I'm gonna take five damage and he's gonna freeze two dice again. Alright. It doesn't matter, he's dead. We did take a lot of damage there, but we level up. Which heals me to full, and we either get Spike Shield. Or boomerang. I'm gonna take a spike shield, and that's a big, yeah, big thing. I don't feel like we don't need a sword. Even deal that much damage, odd gain that much shield. Guessing shield protects us from damage. Oh, a new adventurer, come in. Welcome to the dungeon supplies for you. We got some great stuff in, so in stock. Need socks, weapons, a small house plant? Snake Eye Charm. Roll two ones. That doesn't sound that good. Had four shield. Oh, this stuff's good. All 
We're gonna do eight damage there. We're gonna reroll the six because we just can't use it. That's gonna get us five shield. Oh, I can see what he can do. Yeah, l l l let's get five shield. I'm gonna replace one of these bumps with something else because it's not really doing anything. We're gonna use pirate hook. We don't take any damage. Good. All right, uh, four, do eight damage. And four damage. Maximum damage we can do is 12 damage a turn. Oh no. Actually, I only did six damage, we're fine. And we'll reroll the six, and he dies. All right, I'm gonna, I'm gonna place one of the bumps or something else. Equipment. Matchstick, why not? Just stops him from using a dice. Do you have anything new or no, it's always the same, okay? Alright, let's go down this trapdoor. Oh my god, whoa. I say we go for the level two first. It'll be easier. But you look like you poison or something. Strong gets poison. Does that mean you poison me? Add 4 poison, or do X damage on 6, restore 2 health. Re reroll the 6. Reroll it again. And then we reroll it again. Get a 3, we can bump that, and then do 8 damage. We can. We don't need a shield here. So we're gonna do damage. And then we can't do anything here, so we're just gonna turn. Guessing she's gonna put that into. No, she's gonna do damage and try to poison me. Right, I'm saying we do bump, fury, die. I win. What loot do we get? Another bump, wow. I, I keep getting the same thing. Alright, Sorcerer. Enemy moves. Alright, uh, Cauldron. Do one damage, get a new dice. Do X damage, weakens enemy. Do three damage. Alright, um... Let's do that. Another four, let's do that. Let's burn one of your dice. Right, and then, then, then that's burned. I mean, if you try to place that, oh, you're 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 gonna take damage. You get a new dice. You get a new dice. Okay, uh, that's not good. I'm taking a lot of damage here. I might die. That's weakened. I'm fine with that. That didn't even do anything. Just burns one dice for an even. Still the same thing. We're gonna bump this. We're gonna do a four damage. We're gonna do this. We're gonna re-roll. Reroll. Reroll. It didn't reroll at all. It keeps giving me fives. You're clearly, you're clearly gonna use the eye of that there. Of course. Yeah, why wouldn't you do that? Hopefully, I level up when I kill you. I'm going to. This just kills you. I don't even need to use my fury. Does that, does that stay over time? I hope so. Yeah, it levels me up. So now I'm full health again. And I get an extra die. Shock the enemy, reusable. If remember right, shock means they can't do anything. I'm actually gonna buy that. Cause honestly, matchstick's just not that good. Let's get yeah, nightstick. Sword is good, honestly. Is it better than spike shield? Yeah, we need the sword back. We don't need this health, we can just go attack the Fireman. Fireman is weak to ice. That makes sense. We're gonna do 6 damage here. We're gonna do 4 damage here. We're gonna use Nightstick twice. Meaning, he can't use 2 of his items. He can't use either of his items, he has to waste... Oh, and he can't even use that one. He did burn one of my die, that's fine. Wait, what happens if I just do this? I get an extra dice, okay. 
Let's re-roll this dice. We got a three. Four. Please give me a four. Yes, this is perfect. So we used a four here, the six here, we used a two here, and the four here. I could have killed him if I used a fury. Now, because he needs an even, he can't attack both times. I'm fine with that, though. We have, we have apples. We can heal. Five damage. And then we do this, and he dies. Let me get, what is that, 3 XP off that guy? Good. Alright, health. Health, we're only 6 health off max, it's fine with that. Hey, come come in, come in, I don't think we've met, I've met him, charge of equipment iron here, what's this do? Plus 1 damage. Makes it smaller. Use 2 times. Or does not matter. I think I'd want the battle axe upgraded, how much does it cost? Oh, I guess I only do one thing, okay. Because then that allows us to get, like, another bump in here. Or maybe even a matchstick. Yeah, let's just get a bump, because then we can get more dice. Because if we get a six, then we can just get an extra one. Haunted Jar, you're only, you're only level three. Haunted Jar is strong against poison. It makes sense. Looks like he's spewing out poison everywhere. Just barfing it. We do have Limit Break here. What can you do? Inflict 3 poison or double poison? That's actually not that- that doesn't seem that dangerous right now. Yeah, I'm gonna bump this dice to shock him, though. We're going to combat roll this dice so we at least get- yeah, 4. Do that. We're gonna combat roll this dice. Get a 3, that's fine. Then I can bump this up and shock him again. He rolls four dice, meaning two of his dice are unusable. He's probably gonna use the one. No, he's a bleeding idiot. No, actually, no, that was smart. Same time, it kind of seems dumb. We're gonna bump this dice value, then we're gonna re-roll this die. We get a four, we can use that here. Let's, let's bump this dice value again. Do this, hopefully we get an even. Yeah, we do. We can do damage here. Do this, do this. Let's just shock him again. And for all time's sake, let's shock him four times. He's gonna put it all into blight. Bump. First, let's just hit him with a sword. Then he just dies there. There you go. That was easy. I'm liking this game. This is fun. Level 4, level 4. Uh, you seem like you'd be weak to burn. So, let's sacrifice our... Let's sacrifice one of our bumps for a matchstick. Because you seem like you'd be weak to burn. Maybe take double damage from it. Yeah, Wicker Man is weak to fire. What are his abilities? Deal 9 burn damage, deal 2 burn. I don't think you should be playing a fire, man. You seem like you're gonna burn to death. Alright, um... What we do here is we bump this. We re-roll. We got a 2. I'm hoping for a 4 here, come on. No, the game doesn't want to be kind to me. I'm gonna shock him. Gonna burn him, gonna stab him, and I'm gonna burn him again. Because pretty sure burn goes down one by by one per turn. No, just, just Yeah, so he he he's weak to burn. I'm pretty sure he just took four damage to do that. This is a bad roll. Alright, um like there's a four. We're really good at fours here. Reroll. 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 This? Yeah, that's only useful really there. Could have done more damage. Do I want to shock him again? He rolls three dice. If I shot, yeah, I'm, I'm gonna shock him again, actually. Instead of burning him. That way he can only do one thing.
Now we can just kill him with uh, 8 damage, 5 damage. We do need some healing, we're gonna die. Health. What's over here? Um, a bump for whip. Deal for burn damage on six and inflict burn. Yeah, you know what? Why not? We have like three bumps. Uh, I feel like matchstick isn't that useful. Bump isn't even that useful, really. Let's fight the rhino beetle. Let's burn him to death. No ability, huh? What do you do? Do two times damage, do five damage, lock one dice. So you have battle axe, but my battle axe is stronger. Come on, man. Really? You're gonna do me like that? Alright, uh. Do this, and then do. We could double it. Yeah, why not? Let's do 10 damage to him right here, right now. Probably would have been more efficient to do 6 damage to him twice, but I'm not the smartest. Never claimed to be smart. He's gonna do 4 damage to me, and then he's gonna try to do that. We might be able to actually kill him. Because we're gonna do this. We're gonna reroll this to try to get a 4 out of it. A 1. That's. We can do 2 damage. Alright, that's fine. I'm saying we shock one of his equipment and do a 5 damage to him. Because now he can't use that. He can do 8 damage to me. Because that's all he can do. Really need to level up here. Do damage, like burn, and then we just kill him. Could have killed him like one turn sooner if I just not done that. Yeah, okay, we, we, we leveled up. Shield Bash. Bash with shield, do shield damage, plus die. Or we can upgrade equipment. This seems good, actually. Yeah, I'll take it. So now, spiked shield over sword. And instead of nightstick, we take shield bash. And instead of whip, we take a bump. Let's try this. A hammer. Do damage and inflict shock. Is that a small thing or that that's big? Okay. If that was small, then maybe, but it's, it's 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 big. I can't. Where are we? We're here. We have to fight Aurora. So we're gonna get in five shield. If we do this, then we deal 5 damage. Yeah. Then we use Battle Axe. Wait, I forgot. Look what you can do. You can freeze and you can heal. That's not where we die. If she didn't roll so awfully. We could use a Fury here if we get a 4. Yeah, we did get a 4, so I'm going to Fury here. Going to shield that we don't take as much damage. And we can bash again. Because we don't lose shield at the end of the turn. We just lose it if we take damage. Oh my goodness. This could be really good. Wait. She can no longer attack. She can just heal. Oh, but then she gets new. Now we just kill you. Goodbye. You haven't been here long, have you? I can still smell the rain on you. I can see the last glimpse of sunlight in your eyes. Are we getting 4 XP? That was a level 4 enemy. Singer's level 5. What spike shield do? No limit, sure. That helps. We can now do 6 damage. Repeat next action. Honestly, I think that might be better than Nightstick. 
Let's find Singer. Singer's probably gonna kill me. We bump this dice. Reroll one. Reroll another one. Reroll this two. We got a three. We could gain some shield here. Let's gain five shield. Shield damage. And then put this towards it, leaving us with one to do. Sad verse. So you weaken me. High note. Jeez, that does a lot of damage. Four dice. Maybe shock would have been really good here. Oh well. I expect that I will not win this first try. There's no way, right? I don't get it. Next equipment has plus one use this turn. Oh, that's really bad. Let's get some shield. Let's do four damage to her. Let's bump this dice and then reroll it. Because I'm a bleeding idiot. She's just going to keep weakening me. Oh no, she's gonna do 12 damage. 12 weakening damage. Hopefully it does not hit the chocolate cookie again. Hits the chocolate cookie again. It's bad. Alright, um... Just re-roll the die. We can bump this dice. Fury is dealing... 8 damage, plus 8 damage. If I reroll this and I get a 6, it's not like you can do anything, yeah. Alright, this enemy is powerful because the weekend is strong. And doing 12 damage is a lot. Stun would have been so much better there. Haven't even gotten the chance to. Okay, now we can use Chocolate Cookie. So, what we could do is this Chocolate Cookie Power. Deal six damage twice. That's useless. <laughs> All right, we gain five XP at least. Oh yes, heals. Level four, or level five. Let's go for the level four Dire Wolf before we go for a level five Cowboy. I think it's a gun or something. He probably has that that Snake Stare as well, doesn't he? Or something like that. Curse is enemy. What's a curse? Deal damage and inflict poison. Deal damage. I want to gain 5 shield here. Then I want to get this down to be, be only needing 1. He's probably, yeah, he's probably going to do lots of damage to me. It's going to hurt a lot. It's going to hurt like all our shield. Alright, um. Do this. And we now do two, we do eight damage twice. We bump this dice and now we do six damage. We're gonna take a load of damage here. I can just feel it in my bones. Oh, we get cursed. All equipment has a 50% chance to fail. Disappears once triggered. All right. I was really hoping that would fail, all right. Yeah, I knew it. Guys, I have to roll four. Hmm. Maybe this wasn't the best idea. You can curse me again. And just do damage. It's smart. Smart dog. But you're also a very, very dead dog. Man, that was, that was a difficult fight, alright. We're gonna fight the cowboy, this is probably where we die, honestly. We do have our limit break, so what we... We could get double fury. Let me see, um... Actually, yeah.
We did eight damage three times. He's down to 18 health. Roll two sixes. Midnight charm. That seems really good because that gives you plus two. Needs six year. Needs six. Can that's that, that honestly? I like this character. If he puts ten in here, he gets to fire twice. If he rolls three sixes, he gets to fire all of them. That's powerful. We could actually. If we get a four here. If we get a four, we do not get a four. All right. Um. Do damage. Lower this. Deal two times damage. We could have done it with three there. I'm used to it being even. Only. He gets Midnight Charm again. Wait, we, did we die? We have two health remaining. Why did the music just change? It's because I was about to die? That's probably why. Okay, we get, we're at max level. We receive one extra dice. Okay, let's see. Let's have this shop before we leave. 13 gold coins. Upgrade equipment. Discharge damage. Take damage to charge. This does not seem good. Let's get upgrade equipment. Alright, um... It's not that good. Um... Forget the spiked shield. It just becomes a single... Oh, no, it's already upgraded. Uh, let's go to my backpack. What can I upgrade here? The hammer becomes a small item. That might be good, actually. Sword does increase damage. We can do seven damage here. Yeah, sure, let's upgrade the sword. I know it's not tiny, but... This whole shield bash idea just does not work. Alright, let's go. Warrior versus... I'm not even sure how to say that name. Is this the boss? This is the boss fight, isn't it? This is where we die. I expect you to die. I mean, I, I thoroughly expect it to, to just die. Immune to lock and freeze. Well, good thing I, not, I brought neither. Ah, for the lost cares of the wind. The call of the birds in the air. Oh, well, in the absence of any of that, this fight will do nicely. 70 HP. What are your abilities? You're just a witch, but more powerful. Shock's not very useful on you. Um... Come on. Come on. Seven damage. Let's lower this. Do this. Shock you. And... Let's do, just do this. Shock you again. Hopefully whatever dice you roll, I've shocked. You rolled a two, please please tell me you got. Yes. Oh, no way, that's wrong. I thought it went like that. I did not do that. I'm an idiot. I was like, man, I'm s that's just the best. But no, okay, yes, can't use locked dice. Oh, well. Yeah, I have a feeling we're gonna die here. I can feel it in my fingers, and I can feel it in my toes. We're gonna die. really don't feel like it's worth shock shocking her, but if I get really lucky and it shocks the four, no, it shocked the shadow. We got four freeze. Four of our dice are turned into one. All of our dice are one. Alright, let's reroll everything. Just roll off what we get. Deal seven damage. Deal six damage. Get closer to repeating the next action. Oh, I should have brought something that actually did damage. I was tiny. All right. Um, now you're gonna do the storm. Deal 12 damage and shock six of my equipment. All my equipment just gets shocked. All right. Let's get this sword. Deal seven damage. We don't have the ability to even use the battle axe. I just reroll. Get a four. Oh, I should have fury on one of those. All right. Um. A two. So you're gonna use do do four damage, lock two dice. That's we might actually kill her. This is actually looking pretty good for me. Oh 
Come on, give me something good. I mean, it's not bad. But it isn't good, by any means. Okay, we do 6 damage here. We repeat next action, and we do 7 damage twice, she dies. In fact, we overkilled her by 1 HP. We actually won our first go? What? Congratulations! Your very first victory. Am I super strong now? Well, no. But look, you've beaten- you, But look, you're off to a great start. You've beaten a whole episode. Just 35 increasingly difficult episodes to go. Wait, what? 35? Increasingly difficult? Of course, every time you beat an episode, you get a chance to spin the wheel. If the wheel ends up on a star, you leave your dungeon if you take home your heart's desires. You ready to spin the wheel? Spin the wheel. You're not. I am chanting. Oh, sorry. Spin the wheel. Oh, I was talking about the die, not me. Spin the wheel. Here we go. I'm clear this is rigged, right? Clearly it's rigged. I mean, everything's rigged. Ah, bad luck. No prize this time. But never mind, there are plenty of episodes to come. Spin the wheel. Spin the wheel. You can stop chanting now. We did episode one, Warriors Welcome. We unlocked the thief. I'm here to have fun and fight monsters. Back home I love working out, long, watches, long walks on the beach, and working out. Thief. I'm not here to make friends, I'm here to win. Everybody else is too, of course, they're just lying about it. We've only more than 37 minutes in, let's try the thief. <laughs> Put your hands together for the next hapless, oh. <laughs> uh, hopeful challenger. He's got big hopes, big oh, dreams, no. and he signed a legally bind binding agreement not to sue us. <laughs> it's the thief. Wait, you meant the dice thing literally? I mean everything literally. Cereal? So tell me, thief, what brings you to my arena of terrible faith? Okay, a dice. Good. Right, well, my friends don't seem to be taking this as serious seriously, but I am. I'm going to win a billion dollars. And what will you do with the money if you win? Anything I want. For the rest of my life. A billion dollars is not that much. You should ask for 18 trillion dollars. And gold, of course. Mm. No, I'm just asking for 18 trillion dollars. We'll get there eventually. At least that's what people who haven't met me believe sometimes. <laughs> Let's get started. I mean, she is Lady Luck. Of course, she's... Dodds are in her favor. I'm gonna say we go for the Gardener first. I don't even know how this thief works. We're probably gonna die here. But I haven't died yet. Lock picks. Split a dice in two. Reusable, max 3, or deal damage and on a 6 flick a week. And we can just do deal damage and do 2 damage. There's really no point right now in splitting a dice in 2 unless we have like a 1. Can we split a 1 in 2 and just get 2 1s? You just have Shovel. I have Shovel. Wait. Why do I have Shovel as well? Splits value in two. Again, this is not a... Oh no, it just doesn't split the dice in two. It just it just gives you half the value back. Am I stealing his... Wait, we're the thief. We're stealing his shovel, aren't we? We're, we're just walking up behind him, stealing his shovel to just bash his brains in with it. And there you go. I killed him with his own shovel. Let me just check to make sure I'm not crazy. We don't have a shovel yet. We just stole it from him. Bump, that's actually good. You can split a dice in two and then increase his value, then split it in two. It's increased value, split dice in two. That's not right. I gave you a six, you gave me a one and a five. It's not really how I expected that to work, but. Minimum three, this is a maximum three. A lucky roll. Roll, roll four extra ones. You know what? Let's do it. I'm just gonna hit him with a dagger repeatedly for one damage. Death by a billion paper cuts. You can't even use it. You can only use one. Now he's dead. Laser guns actually seems pretty good. 
Now level two, get an extra dice, good. The more dice, the better. Okay, we're not forced to take the health. We can just walk right past it. Needs a three. If I split this dice in two, I have a chance to get a three. I mean, I didn't get it. But that's fine with me. He has to inflict more poison on me. Is it just is it just showing me what he's gonna use next? Hall of Mirror. Plus one dice in this fight. Let's just, let's just, let's just stab him repeatedly. Okay, split this dice in two. I can't. That's illegal. That doesn't make any sense. How do you split a one into two ones? Alright, yeah, it just shows me what he's gonna use, so I know what he's gonna use. He's gonna use Hall of Mirror again. I should split this dice in half. Oh well. We could unlucky roll, but I don't feel like it. I feel lucky, not unlucky. Yeah! It just shows- okay, it does not show me that he's ever gonna be able to do that because he has plus one. Now he's plus two? We have to kill him soon. Oh, thank you. Thank you very much. Now I can kill you. A lot. Like, you're gonna die. But dude, seriously. I have so many dice. Like, dude, seriously, you're just gonna die. He does have three dice, though. Dodge next attack twice. He's gonna dodge one of my attacks, it's fine. Let's freeze him. I froze him to death. Let's heal. Let's take the treasure and then we'll fight the pirate. Leather armor reduces one damage from each attack. Is that really any good? I mean, I'm, I'll take it. Yeah, so I cannot just walk past these guys. Walk past anything else that's not an enemy. I mean, I'm, I'm thoroughly expecting to die eventually here. Dude, we just stole his pirate hook. Dude, it does like the worst splits in the history of splitting things. It's like you're gonna, you're gonna split a pizza of your friend and your friend gives you one slice and he takes the rest. And you're like, Jeremy, you, you said we're going to split the pizza. You didn't say you're going to take the whole thing. And then Jeremy says, well, we, I did split it. Look, you have a slice. I have a slice. I don't know anyone named Jeremy. And based off my description of someone who's named Jeremy, I'm glad I don't. Let's use leather armor, right? Yeah, sure, why not? Alright, Mr. Pirate, you gonna shoot me now? With your cannon? No, you're not. I, say, I thought I was gonna get shot with the cannon there. Alright, um... I need a fiber last. Lockpick. I'm still pretty sure that's not how splitting things works. Oh, he just dies. Good. Let's get crowbar. I don't have anything that has a... I didn't have anything that has a cooldown. But now I do. Can I buy another thing from you? I'd also like to buy counterfeit. Who needs leather armor in? Increasing a die's value. I mean... Duplicated die- What? This- this feels- I'm not sure if this is actually strong, but this feels strong. Cause sure, I've only rolled two ones, but... Duplicated dice. Roll two ones. Split a dice in two. Why? Why is this allowed? 
even. Can't use this anywhere, so I guess put it put it there. That, that this feels strong. You're gonna both blind me. I mean, I guess I can't see the value on a dice. I guess that's probably what that means. Yeah, I can't see what dice this is. Hmm. It was a two. Duplicated dice. Deal damage. Deal damage. The blind's not very strong. Please just keep blinding me. It doesn't do anything really. Alright, we know it's more than a three. Duplicated dice. Split the dice in two. Death by a billion paper cuts. I love this. Ah, you win. That was so clever. It was so much fun playing with you. Please visit me again. I get so bored and lonely here. Are these other people that she's trapped in the dungeon who have lost all hope of them actually winning and just came up and decided to fight any adventurers who came in? Where are we? Okay, we're here. Let's fight the Dryad. Strongest poison. Well, I'm gonna steal your poison. Unlucky roll. Death by a billion paper cuts. You know the drill. Again, why is this a thing? Why is this allowed? Wish there was an easier way to do it. This not to drag each individual one over to attack her. I mean, I didn't do that much damage, but it just feels overpowered just to do it. I'm gonna deal five damage and grant it to the poison slingshot. We really need to heal here. Can I please steal the the Venus flytrap? That would have been nice. Because this allows me to have a use for the sixes, because Dagger can't use six. I can split a dice in two, which gives me that. Then I can duplicate a dice. Put this here. Because why not? And just repeatedly stab her. Okay, yeah. We're going to get Poison Slingshotted. No, that's right, because she can heal. That's why she didn't. Alright, uh, unlucky roll. When it's actually very, very lucky. Split the dice in two. Duplicate the two. Probably would have better to duplicate a three than split it in half. Because then I would have had a two and a three, meaning I would have done slightly more damage. Alright. Love the fact that I can just use this infinitely. I might die here, though. I'm quite certain of it. I am gonna get poisoned. I'm at 3 HP. If I don't kill her this turn, I die. Split a dice in two. Roll two ones. Duplicate a die. Should have duplicated the three. I can poison her. At the very least. Alright, there we go. Almost died. I actually think I might die. This is difficult. Difficult, but with a T at the beginning. This is increased damage. This is two uses. This just makes it smaller. Let's just upgrade this, make it smaller. Put something else in here as well. Uh, bump. Let's also increase the value of a dice before throwing it away. Let's heal, let's heal, let's buy. Survive the next fatal blow. It does not stack. None of this stuff seems like good except for the pea shooter. Let's fight the cactus. You seem weak. I can sense your fear. I can smell it. 
What does thorns do? Increase die value. Roll two ones. Duplicate it two. Split it in two. What does thorns do? Whenever an enemy attacks, they take one damage for each thorns. How much damage do you do? You do like no damage. Okay. Let's get ourselves two thorns. Why not? The way he takes damage when he attacks us. Five damage is a lot of damage. Really like the music here. Oh, dude, I'm taking damage every time I hit him because of that. Does this just mean we take infinite damage if I do this? I think I- no, I, I just die. I'm dead. First time for everything, even losing. Thief was defeated. Alright, guess we'll end the episode with us being defeated. We've unlocked the robot. I want to beat the game as a thief before we do that. Anyways, that's going to do it for Dicey... Hey, that used to be a... Oh, I get it. Each one of these is a character. And that's going to do it for Dicey Dungeons. Hope you all enjoyed. Uh, we won as the warrior and we lost as the thief. That's fine with me. Um... I already said this at the very beginning, but make sure to like and subscribe and go follow me on Rumble. I really do hope you all enjoyed. Go watch some of my other uh, videos. And do let me know down in the comment section if you want more Dicey Dungeons.